Roll Hats Weekend 2023 is coming up at Quincy High School, October 6th and 7th this year. School pride, school spirit on display all over Quincy High. Joining us today to talk a little bit more about it, let you know how you can participate, Coach Bob Noble, also Quincy High School seniors, uh, Tom Curtin and uh, Anna McPhillips. So welcome, first of all, to all of you. Thanks for coming over. Appreciate Thank it. Thank you. Thank, Thank you for having us. Got the, uh, the garb on already, <laughs> so we're setting the stage here for that spirited weekend. But Coach, let's start off um, with you, if we can, and tell us a little bit uh, about roll hats. How did that start and what does it mean? Well, it started uh, when I was coaching down at Hing Hingham High School. Every year they would have essentially, uh, a, you know, an outdoor, a homecoming type weekend mm. in which uh, all the clubs and activities would have tables completely around their uh, athletic field. And they would get a tremendous response from uh, the people of Hingham at this. And I you know, I kept seeing that for the years I was there, and I was like, this is something, when, my, when I stopped coaching, this is something that I'd like to see if I can bring to Quincy. Okay. Uh, we have probably the finest athletic facility there is in Eastern Massachusetts for high school sports, uh, that being the stadium. Um, it gives you a venue that uh, is just purely, you know, is completely um, uh, set up for this, uh, uh, show so uh, having the clubs and the various activities there uh, it's it's going to make for a great day and uh, last year it was a great success we're hoping that uh, this year it'll be even more so uh, we've, we've done a few things uh, differently which I'll leave to the to the Royal Hats kids here yes absolutely and, uh, so is this was that the first year last year last year was the first year okay. yes and uh, I Again, I can't uh, uh, tell you how much I appreciate the effort by the, uh, the faculty at Quincy High, Quincy High School, uh, the athletic director, Kevin Mahoney. Sure. Uh, that, you know, there's a lot of, as, as with many things, there's a lot of behind, behind the scenes uh, things that go on that allow for this to happen yeah. or anything for it to happen. And uh, they do all the work uh, and they've done a great job. They did a great job last year and from what I can see, or understand they've done a tremendous job this year. Well, you mentioned the stadium. It has come a very long way over the it past most certainly has. several years, both outside with the, the yes. wall, uh, the brick exterior yes. being uh, spruced up, but the interior is uh, miles better than it used to be. Yeah, it yeah. is. But it, it, again, it's, I think, unfortunately, sometimes uh, some of our young people get kind of spoiled by that um, in the sense that, uh, you know, for example, be it football or soccer or whatever the case, they play a lot of games in there from youth league all the way up to and through high school. Yes, yeah. Um, and, you, you know, having been coaching in a number of other different places, uh, it's not, they're not nearly as nice as what we have here. And is I that think right? Sometimes I think the kids don't realize how, yeah. how lucky they really Which are. Which is a good thing, right? A absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. I mean, Although they may be disappointed when they move on to the higher level. <laughs> it could be, yeah, there yeah. are, uh, some it, it is fair colleges, to say there are yeah. some of the smaller colleges yeah. don't have anything nearly as nice as, uh, as right. Well, we've stadium. got a championship rugby team now that calls yep. the stadium their home. It certainly so, helps. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. So let's bring in... Uh, Anna and Tom and talk a little bit about Roll Hats and what you guys are doing to be involved with Roll Hats. So Tom, let me ask you, what does that mean to you, first of all? So with Roll Hats, it's just we're technically considered the Madam and Mr. President of Class of 2024. What is it? Madam and, Madam and Mr. President, oh. a play on the mascot. But okay. so te um, what we do is we just kind of share school spirit. We run it. And on the days we on the days October 6th and 7th, we will be like help running around, um, interviewing clubs and activities and sports and really just getting a feel for why they're here and what they want to get out of it. Yeah, so it's important to mention it's not just sports, right? No, it's a whole school experience. Yeah, yeah. So what are some of the different organizations that are involved? As of right now, we know we have it, tw I think over 20 and to name a few, it's the Interact Club, Girls Soccer will be there, I think Girls Lacrosse, yeah. and um, Band, Drama, what other clubs do you know of? I think robotics will be there as yeah. well. Okay. There's just to name so a few. So wide representation. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. What are you involved with specifically yourself? Um, I'm involved with Interact Club, the Quincy High Ambassadors, and I also play hockey during the winter. Oh, okay, all right. So did you participate in Roll Hats last year? Um, last year during the fall, I actually attended the games and stuff. No. I wasn't able to make it to the Interact Club table, but I was there for bo girls, boys, and girls and boys soccer and football at night. 
Okay, all right. So, an analyst here, your story, how are you involved with Roll Hats? Um, As I, aside from being Madam, Madam Class of 2024, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, just like the same thing, like we're going to be walking around and inter like interviewing every table. Um, and I also play soccer and lacrosse, so I'll be playing during the soccer game. And then I can also help with the lacrosse table okay. when I'm not interviewing. Okay, because can you tell us exactly what it's so it's a two day event, right? It's, yes. yes. What will actually be happening October 6th and 7th, so it's Friday and Saturday? Yeah. Okay. So, so starting October 6th, yeah. which is the Friday, at 2 p.m., we'll have the clubs and activities fair in the cafeteria. Okay. Followed by the girls' volleyball game at home in the gym at 5 30. Okay. And then starting the next day on Saturday, it'll be an all day event. We'll have clubs and activities set up all around the stadium, we'll have music, games. Um, family fun stuff, we'll have bouncy houses, and then starting at 1230, we'll have girls soccer mm -hmm. with the one and only Madam President. Yes. <laughs> yes. And then we'll have boys soccer, and then at night, we'll have football under oh. the lights. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's, who's playing football? Not us. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, Quincy High? Or oh, mean, Quincy yeah. High, yes. Yeah, okay. Yes. All right. Yeah. Obviously, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right. We can't not talk about the outfits. <laughs> oh, the hats? Oh, yeah, those. The hats? Oh, those are just a part of our everyday yeah. outfits Oh, now. really? You just show up on the bus yeah. with those? Yeah. <laughs> I eat, sleep, and breathe these hats. And right in? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, who created the hats? Where did they come from? What do they mean? The hats are kind of a play on the mascot of Quincy High, which is the president's hat. Yeah. And starting last year, we kind of took on from, um, like, Crimson Tide, Alabama. So we, and they say Roll Tide. So we kind of adopted that and say okay. Roll Hats. All right. Yeah. Has it clicked? Is it is it you know kind of a thing now? Yeah. 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 It has most definitely clicked. Okay. There's a lot of people saying it around the school. Okay. Just yeah. the other day, Anna and I were in the hallway, and we had a few people say Roll Hats to us. So <laughs> it's definitely clicking. Okay. Are there banners up around school? And yeah. Uh, we have a how many do we have two in the gym? Mm, yeah. Yes. One on yeah. each end. Okay. Shirts also, I see? Yeah. Shirts, yes. We have all of the apparel. Okay. Uh, now, do you want folks to wear their roll hats? Garb of course. Roll yes. Hats we actually have a theme for all the events, and it's uh, red, white, and blue. Okay. So if you wear the shirt, you have red, white, and blue in it. Okay. All right. Yeah. Does that get you any special privileges for roll hats weekend? <laughs> no. <laughs> just sadly. showing school spirit, <laughs> yeah. right? Yeah, just showing school spirit. Yeah. So is that kind of the overall goal of, of the event? Uh, maybe, Coach, you can talk a little bit about yeah, that. Yeah, I think yeah. that was the initial... Um, uh, reason for me to do this, yeah. you know, behind uh, everything, was that um, th there's a lot of great kids at Quincy High School, yeah. and there's a lot of wonderful things that go on there, and we want to show that to people, and because we're, we're proud of what they all do, and uh, but also there is there is spirit there. Mm -hmm. we've, we've just got to bring it out sometimes, and this uh, this is doing that and has done that from. Last year to now, has it really? Have you noticed it? Uh, oh, absolutely. Have. Really, um, there's far, you know I I go to some of the games when I, when I can. And yeah, there's been a fairly large representation of uh, the student body there, um, and which is great. And uh, they, you know, definitely um, show the the spirit that is capable of going. Yeah, to Tom and Anna, would you agree? Is that I mean? From, oh, hundred percent. From the last yeah. event, to yeah, the, really. Uh, yeah, it's definitely picked up, and there's a lot of school spirit. Yep. Um, from firsthand, like, just going to the games, like, I know that everyone, like, will text friends, and, like, everyone always loves to make sure there's a theme, which yeah. I love. Mm -hmm. And just keeping on theme is the best part of it. Like, everyone just showing up, like, we've had construction worker theme nights, <laughs> um, neon, we've had jersey, it's just to name a few. USA is a big theme since our school yeah. colors are red, white, and blue. Of course. So yeah. we thought we'd bring in the school spirit with that by making that the theme for Roll Hats Weekend. Okay. All right. Yeah. So and how about you, Anna? Has it has been your experience also that yeah. folks have got more spirit? Yes, definitely. Yeah. The, everybody always dresses to the theme, I feel like, for especially football games. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. Now, there was a, uh, a video produced uh, about Roll Hats Weekend. Tell me about uh, how that got put together and, 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 and who did that. Um, with the help of Scott Campbell, we actually were able to film that video, and it was fun to be able to like participate in it and then have it be played in school mm -hmm. and like kind of see have everyone be like, oh my god, like that's so cool. Like we've had random teachers come up to us and be like, oh, I love those videos you're doing, and I'm like, oh, like thank you. <laughs> Okay, so who produced that? Who was it? You guys that put that together? Um, um, Scott Campbell did. Oh, Scott did. Yeah. 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 All right, but I think you know I watched it, and the interesting thing you might agree is that it it represents not just what you think of as you know high school sports or yeah. high school activities, as you mentioned the Interact Club, the Karama Club, 
golf. You know, I mean, the things that most people, coach, wouldn't even uh, consider. That, that's the whole point of it. Yeah. Is there were several. I mean, there not were. Not just the athletic. Probably do a dozen teams actually. here, but right. all the clubs and activities that go, you know, all the things that go on at Quincy High School. Yes. That I think a lot of people aren't aware of. And that's what we want to do. We want to emphasize there are a lot of good things going on there, a lot of good uh, opportunities for you if you're a student here to get involved. Mm. And that's the whole point of it. Yep, absolutely. So, uh, Tom, Anna, what do you want the public to do for Roll Hats Weekend? What do you want Quincy residents to, to know about this weekend, and what would you like them to do to take part in it? What we would like them to do is just show up, okay. to help, help um, spread the word of Roll Hats Weekend, um, just really give the kids playing like a lot of um, support as mm -hmm. they get on the field, and then definitely walk around at the stadium and check out the clubs and tables. I know there will be fundraising done, so definitely come ready to be generous. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. I know. Well, how about yourself? What would you yeah, like to do? Definitely just showing up to the games and then um, if they can, donating to the tables okay. that are there. Can they make their own hats? They yeah. most <laughs> certainly can. <laughs> 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 we would love to see that, actually. Yeah. Okay. Who knows? A roll hats contest. Yeah. Perhaps. Um, is this all over social media, I'm guessing? Yes. yes. So we okay. do have a roll hats Instagram and Facebook account. Yeah. And then we have an email for contact in case anyone wanted to help reach out and um, help like volunteer yep. or just get more details. What is that, Tom? That is qhsrollhats at yeah. gmail.com. OK. Very good. Do you need any help or volunteers or? Um, we could use any help anyone wants to give or help out with. Um, definitely just reach out to that email, um, and we'll let you know. We'll put If we have volunteers, we'll place you where we need you. Okay. But definitely setting up could be helpful. Or cleaning up. Or cleaning yeah. up as well. <laughs> People yes. can get that part of it. Yeah. OK. Uh, very good. Anna, anything else you wanted to add? Uh, no. OK. <laughs> uh, again, roll hats, uh, QHS roll hats at gmail.com. Yes. Yeah. OK. Um, let's ask about your futures, because you're seniors. Yeah. Graduating next year. Yes. Tom, do you have any So plans? after high school, I would love to attend um, UMass Amherst and okay. study um, nursing. Really? Yeah. OK. Very good. How about yourself, Anna? Uh, I would like to do the same thing, study nursing too, but not too sure where. Not yet. too sure. Yeah. But both nursing. Okay. Yeah. Well, there's a growing need, as you well know, for sure. Yeah. Yes. Uh, very much. Yeah, very much so. Coach, anything you want to add? Well, just uh, we're, we're going to try to expand it every single year and make it every, better every single year. Yeah. Uh, now, for example, uh, this year we're um, including the clubs and activities fair on Friday in the cafeteria, okay. which was not a part of last year. And also, what I think is a big um, addition is the the band uh, performing on, on Saturday. Yeah. Uh, I think, uh, as I hope many people have seen, or if they haven't seen, come and see the band as much as they Boy, talk about it's coming a long way. A long, it's come a long way from uh, f from a long t from quite a while ago. Yes, and uh, they've they perform extremely well. They are um, yep. And it's you know when you get to see them, perhaps in the the, the general public generally gets to see them maybe Thanksgiving Day mm -hmm. or, or Flag Day, mm -hmm. whatever the case may be. Yep. This is another opportunity for the band to um, really show what they are, which is uh, which is a very they make up a very good program. Oh, you know, Something to be very much be proud of. Yeah, Mr. Demarco has taken that program yes, he and has. really run with it. Uh, the kids not only look great with their new uniforms, right, but they sound great too. That's right. Yeah, and now I mean I know they were award-winning band now. Yeah. So so it's good. Yeah, it's another feather in your hat. <laughs> so to speak. <laughs> <laughs> the hats make it, by the way. Right. Yeah. Thank you. Absolutely. Now, will you, will you both be wearing these uh, on Roll Hats Weekend? Yeah. Yeah, so no. folks can pick you out in the crowd. And yeah. Yes. <laughs> All right. Very good. Hey, thanks a lot for coming in. Really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Thank you for having us. Uh, it's our pleasure, and I hope you have a great weekend. I'm not even going to ask about inclement weather. <laughs> <laughs> not even going to go Don't there. Don't jinx it. No. Yeah. Right. Don't just say it's 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 a go, Rain or Shine, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. As, as it stands right now. <laughs> as it stands yes. right now. Okay. Thanks again. Really good to talk to you all. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for watching Thank us you. here at AM Quincy. I'm Joe Catalano. We will see you next time. Ready? On three. One, two, three. Roll Roll